Hi, this is Brothers and Sisters channel. I'm glad to have you here on YouTube again. So we can discuss more and about the creation and if there's any truth to it. What God God's word says in the Bible. So let's go into it. I have a article here from Jamie Durant. She works with the Institute for Creation Research. If you've not been there, you should definitely go to their website and see what they have. Because they have a lot of content. When did the dinosaurs live? Did they walk the earth at the same time as humans? What happened to them? How did they fit on the ark? Don't dinosaurs prove a level of evolution? You no doubt heard these questions. Their answers have been long hidden, buried in the rocks and fossils and smoothed by evolutionary ideas. Evolutionists tell us dinosaurs lived millions of years ago. But scientists at the Institute for Creation Research and other creation organizations have uncovered evidence that tells a different story. Dinosaurs' fossils hold secrets, and God's word reveals their true history. For too many years, we let evolutionists mislead our culture. About these mysterious creatures, evolutionists proclaim a different message from the biblical amount, account of creation. And our children have struggled with this, with the confusion for the long. The stories evolutionists tell in schools, museums, and films cause our children to doubt that God provides answers in every area of life, even dinosaurs. How can we give our children confidence in what the Bible teaches? Let's start with a few fast, fast facts. Number one. Dinosaurs were created on day 6 of creation week, along with the other land animals and humans. 2. Dinosaurs walked on earth at the same time as humans, though perhaps not often in the same places. 3. The Bible mentions a beast called Bemihat that matches a kind of dinosaur, Levitian 2 appears to have been a huge dinosaur-like creature that may be the source of a dragon stories through the years. Legends and historical accounts from around the world include this this was number four. Legends and historical accounts from around the world include dinosaurs like creatures as dragons. In the case the humans actually witnessed real dinosaurs alive after the flood. The six or so basic kinds of other dinosaurs could easily fit off the on the ark. This is number five. Number six, scientific research on soft tissues, skin, blood, and other tissues discovered in dinosaurs' fossils confirms that dinosaurs lived thousands, not millions, of years ago. Seven, Noah's world flood, worldwide flood formed dinosaur fossils found on every continent, including Antarctica. So the, I think these steps are great. Yeah. The dinosaur says number two, what dinosaurs walked on earth at the same time as humans. So that means we should be finding what? We should be finding Evidence of humans together with dancers, like on sculptures, paintings, legends, and that is exactly what we find. So, there's not more truth to the creationists have than the evolutionists. They don't have all these, they can't tell you that the dinosaurs walked on earth at the same time as humans. 
Why do the legends, hundreds, thousands of legends tell us that there were li dinosaurs living with humans? The word dinosaur is from 18. 83 I think and these this is the word dinosaur didn't come until 1883 dragons was the word for dinosaurs and dragons is the word that was used in the legends so every time they say a dragon and they describe her it looks really a lot like a dinosaur. And we will go dig deeper into the legends and what the legend says and every and descriptions and of the dinosaurs and, and we will just look into it together. See what we can find. <coughs> Soft tissue and blood cells. They are finding they should not find blood cells and skin tissues on dinosaur bones, but they find these everywhere around the world. The reason is for a young creation, a young earth. Young dinosaurs, not millions of years of old dinosaurs, that's the reason. God's word is the truth, and if we just like take the Bible, read it, you'll find on job that he is talking about the dinosaurs as it says here in number three the bible mentions a beast called behemoth behemoth it matches the kind of dinosaurs this dinosaurs this dinosaur is huge and his tail is like a seed is like a caesar tr tree like a tree his tail is like a tree. What animal has a tail like a tree other than a dinosaur? It's not a giraffe. It's not, not a hippo. Seen a hippo. Their tail is like five inches. It's not a A rhino. It's not a. It's nothing but a dinosaur. Dinosaur has a tail like a tree. Oh yeah. Thank you for watching and I'll be here with you soon, hopefully in two days, it's just we are very busy but we are gonna try our very best to make videos two days from now, two days, one day in between, every second day I mean, every second day okay. Yeah, thank you for watching, thanks to my subscribers, and we'll be with you soon, bye bye.